There's a myth that airplanes always land into the wind. Sounds logical, but the truth is, that's not always the case. Yes, headwinds help slow the aircraft, shorten the landing roll, and make touchdowns safer. That's why pilots prefer them. But in the real world, airports don't always allow it. Sometimes aircraft land with cross winds, or even partial tailwinds. Why? Because airports manage traffic flow, noise abatement and parallel runway operations. Safety margins are built in so jets can handle it. Modern jets have certified crosswind limits. For example, a Boeing 737 can handle around 33 knots of crosswind. Airbus designs are similar. Pilots train extensively for these situations using techniques like crab and side-slip landings. So while landing into the wind is ideal, reality isn't always textbook. Pilots and airports balance wind with bigger operational needs, proving not every landing lines up with the breeze. Now here's the debate. Would you trust a crosswind landing, or does it make you grip the armrest a little tighter?